guys, Deathmog91 here. So, I'm going to go ahead and do, let's do a little bit more. Let's play, I was on my normal cert game and I was on peaceful mining. Yeah. So, guys, this is what I've done. I've expanded my house. I've cleared it out. I gave myself a little uh, skylight. There's like nothing in my house yet. But that's because I didn't want to go too crazy. I dug up back here, and basically, I'm thinking about making a mine shaft right here. Uh, yeah. Okay, that one piece. Of, do I have any normal? Okay, cool. I do. That one piece of dirt is just really like it's out of place. So yeah. Also, I got more glass cooking. Uh, just a ton of crap I should have probably taken out beforehand. But comparing, I joined in live. Actually, no, I want that crafting bench and the wood. I don't know whenever I'm going to need shit. Oh, I got wood right there. I gotta take the. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay, that's fine. I got me some food and whatnot. So, yeah, I'm going to explore the world a little bit more. And see if we can find another. My shaft. Okay, that is kind of annoying. So let me see. Can I get rid of you two? Okay, that's better. I've just got to go through real quick. I thought I had actually figured it out. But I guess I didn't. I thought I could remove that. But yeah, so basically, I gave myself a little grass uh, walkway, and yeah, it was kind of fun doing all that shit. And I, I know that there's coal right there, but yeah, I'll go out to the view. Although I think I should have removed that one piece of dirt, which actually I can probably just I'm gonna go ahead and do now. I thought I had finished it all, but guess not. Now that looks better. Don't you guys hate that when you finish, you think you finished something, it's like, wait, I should have done that. And I'll go ahead and go out to the little island over here. And when I say little island, I mean literally. Look how fucking big this piece of shit island is. I'd call that a little island. Although, it can expand quite a bit. I see a squid. Yeah. I was going to go ahead and grief my some of my uh, friends on here. But yeah. So that's what the house looks like from a distance. Uh, but every time I joined in, either I got kicked, or they were trying to kill me. Yeah, so what had happened was a few nights ago, I got on. I was just bored as hell. Because I was just, you know, I was like, okay, I'm going to fuck around and just see what I can find. And one of the three servers I was on. Oh, what the hell? That's cool. This is kind of badass. Uh, a guy had literally had fucking um, diamond blocks, which, oh, skeleton. Come out here and burn. Yeah. I'm still in sight. You still can't shoot me though. But yeah. I know it's the coward's way of out. But hell. Okay. How the hell did I miss that? And that's a spider. Spider. Your time to die. Yeah. So I might have just found a really nice cave system. Okay. Okay. This one doesn't really lead anywhere, but I see coal, and I saw some iron, which is a plus. So yeah, uh, they had like five or six buckets of lava, and yeah, I just kind of went on. I found this stuff, it's like, I'm thinking, who the fuck leaves lava in the chest in a multiplayer server, which could be griefed. I mean, like, right now, if anybody were to actually friend me and join in, they could. 
Although, for some reason, I am not getting any audio from my TV, so you'd have to, like, PM me. It's not, I know it's not my TV, because I've had this happen before. It's the connection. Like, I've f fucked around with it, and I still get this every now and then. So, it's just one of those issues I have to deal with. So, I don't know if you guys are actually going to hear the in-game sounds. Which, if you don't, sorry guys, but, you know. I can't hear them. It's like, I'm not punishing you guys because I can't hear them, but you can. Or you can't. It's just something that keeps happening every now and then. I can't explain why. If I knew, hell, I would have fixed it. Like. Literally, sometimes it was just as simple as just shutting off the system, unplugging all the wires, and which actually I did beforehand, and I was able to get it fixed like that. Then replugging all the wires in, but sometimes you're not as lucky. Okay, I see more iron. Okay, that's a dead end, but there's iron right here, which I love finding iron. But yeah, guys, uh, make sure that if you're on a server, in Minecraft at least, never leave lava in buckets where people can easily get into them. Okay, it's looks like it's going to be nighttime. I just want to light this place up a little bit more, just because that way I don't have to worry as much. Right now, it's not really like a big cave system, but it looks like later on, if I actually start digging through it, I can I might be able to find something kind of cool. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go back, sleep real quick, before all the mobs start popping up, because I really don't feel like fighting them. I feel like I should put a torch right there. Like, you really can't get a sense of where you actually need torches until uh it's night time like i mean i can guess but that doesn't mean hell i'm gonna be right my dog's outside again i can't help that but yeah uh i'll show you guys the view real quick outside because that's always cool so yeah basically once the lighting fixes I've just got a view of a few mountains and some lakes. It's actually a pretty nice view. Minecraft standards. Uh, I can't wait for like till we get to 1.8 or even 1.0 Minecraft. And the guys who have played that play and I see a fucking creeper. Boom, bitch. Boom, bitch, you died. Literally, you're dead. So yeah, um, <laughs> once we're at like 1.0, we'll have a lot of good shit. And I think it's actually the next update should be coming up pretty soon. Uh, I don't know how soon though. Within like the next month or two, we should have an update. Which, if we do, would be really nice. And I think I just... I hope that's not a light in the air. That is. That is one fucked up light in the air. But yeah. Honestly, the best way to really to find caves is look for them naturally. Or get a, basically a mine shaft that goes all the way down to bedrock. And just branch off. Although, if you like me, and even though you built the mine shaft down, you want stairs. Okay. This area is looking kind of epic. Like, I could, you know, if I would have found this over here, I could see, I could see living over here, or having a second house over here, maybe. But yeah, I think we got a little. Okay, this is actually, this is not a. Okay, yeah, that was a lighting error, but why do I feel like I've been here before? Have you guys ever just had that feeling like I've been here before? But 
I haven't. That is so fucking weird. But yeah, so, I don't know. Uh, don't worry, guys. Unless I've got, like, if I'm going to grief your server, if I get friended by anybody, who I hope I do, uh, I'm going to PM you and say, dude, back up your map or don't save. Just because the fact is, it will actually, for what I've seen, even though it has an auto save feature, it doesn't, uh, if you didn't actually save save the world, I know that just kind of sounded stupid, uh, it doesn't actually save the whole world, and I want to remove you before I go on, just that way, oh, and, uh, place one right there so I can get up. Yeah, uh, it looks like it won't save the whole world, and I'm surprised I haven't found any mobs. And I think I just found lava. Yep. Anytime you see a natural light source in the cave at, that you've never been in, unless somebody else has been in the server, which is plausible but I mean if you do if you have it set up on like invite only and you know for a fact nobody you know has been on like nobody's actually been on this server or you have it set up in your game that you know you uh, that you're the only one playing then nine out of ten times that's lava until they start until the updates uh, the most recent snapshot added quite a bit to the game that's already been known. But yeah. <laughs> I know, this is kind of boring, but this is Minecraft still. I'm just really still surprised that even though I found this place that I haven't been attacked even though I'm on easy still I have yet to be attacked by any mobs since I got into this cave system usually I get attacked right away now because I don't have a bucket what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a piece of lava uh, a cobblestone right there and there now I've still got the natural flow in lava and I'm able to actually just work my way down which is something you need to be able to do because you don't want to have it where it's like the lava is going to just set you on fire <sighs> okay and also guys since lava is a natural light source make sure you put a torch down just because you still don't want it where it's like, oh, okay. The lava is just going to go ahead and replace all my light source. And I'm going to just go ahead and use dirt. Because, I mean, if it gets dark enough, I think the rule of uh, mobs were that they can't spawn within... If they haven't already been spawned, if they don't normally spawn in... They can't spawn within a 25 block radius. So yeah, I think I'm actually fine for the most part. Okay. Uh, safety. I got my safety hole. Well, my safety br uh, block. Okay. So I got more iron right here, which I want to collect. So that way, later on, it's actually going to be very useful, and I hate lighting errors like this, which sometimes it just takes a block's destruction to get it to go right. Although, I've got a perfectly good torch right here. I've got three. I can't explain that. If anybody knows... Comment down below. There should be light right there. But there's not. 
Yeah, that's just weird. And like I don't want any lava right here. Yeah, I cannot explain that and finally a mob. I see a spider. Spider, come at me. Come at me. What the hell? Is that spider stupid or something? Because I should have been attacked by one. Okay, there you guys go. I'm thinking like, what the fuck? Boom. Yeah, okay, so they are aggroed like I was hoping they would be. So, in cave spiders, as even if it's daytime, are still aggroed on you. Uh, if you find them, you can find them through the day. Don't bother attacking them because they're not hostile. And damn you, spider. Where the fuck did you come from? Yeah. So the other fun thing is right now, even though, uh, the reason why, even though I don't need to place torches like where I did so close to each other normally, it's still a system that I don't want. Okay, that's not actually that bad. If it's dark enough where they can spawn, definitely take care of that. Just because you don't want mobs spawning. Although I kind of do, but I don't. I'm thinking I might need to make some more torches, but it looks like I found everything on this path. So, th so that's basically it. I found more iron. Today went pretty nice. Tomorrow I am off. So, but knowing myself, either I'm gonna upload this video today, and it actually gets up today, or I'll upload it tomorrow. I did figure out the problem with the. Well, I figured out one problem, then I have another problem. That seems how it, that's how it is right now. So I did. Uh, I, I'm pretty sure last. Eh, I'm stuttering. I know that. Last episode, I'm pretty sure I said how I fixed it, uh, at least on the, like, for the 360 and PS3, how I fixed that shit. Okay, this is more of annoying than anything else. Uh, I ended up, uh, it was just because I ha didn't have it on the right video settings, which, guys, that will do it. Oh, and I can tell you guys why my dog is barking. Our neighbor, we have new neighbors, and he doesn't know them yet. It's one of those, uh, oh, we got new neighbors, so yeah. It's like, we've told them, you know, it's like, nothing we can do about that. Also, I can't help the fact he got wet outside. Which, I mean, he's an inside dog, but... I don't mind it being outside. I just wish that they would tell me when he's going outside. When it's just that way, I, you know, I would know. And then it's like, okay, don't do a recording session during this time. He's outside. And I already see this being more of a nuisance right here. And I see iron right there, but because I don't know how far, and iron up there, this goes. And see, here's a zombie. So, in Minecraft, oh fuck. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go back a little bit to where I know it's safe that I can do my shit that I have to do. And go ahead. Because I'm... Oh, what the fuck? Okay, it's not safe. Uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and eat that raw pork chop. Guys, I really... Well, actually, I've got a crafting bench. I'm gonna go ahead and use it real quick. Make a furnace. Place the furnace down. Put a few pieces of coal in. 
and start cooking up the pork chops and go ahead and grab the coal that's all like right around here so that way I can fuel it I should have actually just cooked all this pork chop all the pork up so that way I already have it but you know yeah uh pork when it's cooked already will heal a lot more than when it's not cooked like the one pork chop that I'm going to be getting right now should put me at I think nine hearts nine eight and a half cause, so it does about four I'm actually gonna leave my stuff down right here so that way I've got a little area that I can just come back to and I know it's like oh hey cool uh yeah I'm gonna leave that one pork chop in there so that way I come back it's like oh yeah I have a pork chop waiting Right now, I don't recommend doing what I just did, but because I have no clue what the hell's up here, and it looks like nothing, although curiosity usually gets the better of me, which is not a good thing in this game. Being curious isn't a bad thing, but... God, you can really die. See, I mean, I've got, I've got to make a way up here, like a legitimate safe way. So what I'm thinking is, I've got enough dirt, and it's not actually that high. I'm, from where I'm at right now, I could easily just do something like this. and I'd be fine because then uh, you know I'd be fine up here and whatnot okay so go ahead and get rid of those just get rid of all like non-essential dirt blocks since it, I know that there's at least four Okay, I was going to say more than likely there's eight, but there could be more back here. Wow, it's already been like 20 minutes. And I'm nowhere, like, I'm just not done for the night. I'm a little curious to find out what's up here, but I got to do it in such a way that I'm not going to actually, like, kill myself by doing this, because you never want to kill yourself. Okay, so it looks like there was actually nothing at worthwhile up here, but it was still one of those things. It's like, uh, I better check it out just because I don't know, and what I don't know can really come back to, I can't believe I just missed that. Like, I knew that was going to happen with at least the one block or one piece of coal that event that one of those was going to fall through because if you remember when I looked up there uh, you could see that there was a few pieces that were like there was no blocks underneath them like this one right here is going to fall and yeah so yeah okay so what I'm going to go ahead I'm thinking I'll go ahead and just put that other pork chop down there. So that way, then I'm good. And I'll have all the pork chops on me. And maybe I'll make a chest. Just that way, if there's anything like, oh my god, right now I find. That I don't know if I want to, like, I don't want to chance the iron ore. Because the fact is, you know, I don't know. I mean, I can find iron ore and all that but that doesn't mean I'm always gonna have the chance okay so I have a ton tor I have a ton of torches I feel like I should just throw a torch back here for safety and like right there I I mean I can be a little bit anal about how some of the stuff I like pushing but yeah uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get you 
YouTube. So yeah, uh, really the biggest thing you can do is when you start, when you get to an area like I've gotten to right now, which is actually pretty safe and it expands. Since I've already knocked out like everyone except for this path right here, go ahead and make like a little home base. That way, you can put stuff that you don't that you ne don't necessarily want to lose there. I don't know why I did that when I know I could have just jumped that. Like as of right now, I'm not seeing anything because usually you can still see it during the night or not night uh, in the darkness. Like I. I was able to see the zombie. But yeah. Okay, so there's some coal down here. Coal, like, is always worth getting. But yeah. In caves, it has to be dark enough where they can spawn, and they have to spawn like 20 some blocks away. I think it's 25 blocks. I know. I don't know why I know this, but I know if they. Oh, cool. Some more iron. Uh, if a mob or you fall from 20, a height of 24 blocks, you're instantly killed. Uh, this is excluding Enderman, who I know have a different rule. Because they have like, I think they have like 20 hearts instead of the normal amount. But yeah. So yeah, I want to say always check behind coal because, I mean, hell, I found more iron behind some coal. Usually you can find iron and coal together. But yeah, that's just how shit goes. I mean, the fact that I found iron and coal together, it's actually kind of common to find it like that. But yeah. Uh, I'm gonna grab these four, at least these four. Drop off my iron and maybe some coal, depending on how much. And go ahead and continue on. I know what's. Uh, and the other thing I want to do is because of. Uh, shit. I don't. Oh, wait. No, that wasn't the way out. That was dead end. I want to make sure that when I go ahead and leave or was it fuck uh, when I leave I have a way to mark this cave system back just cause I wanna know exactly where the hell this cave system is so way later on I feel like I should have a torch up here I can just come back and say hey cool so this is where the torch the system is and whatnot. Oh yeah, I was up through here. So I went up, then down. Cause I was dealing with all that lava, which I actually for safety, I'm gonna go ahead and just put a block over it. But that doesn't actually get rid of the lava and Oh, skeleton. Where the hell did you spawn from? Oh, we got another one. And I missed iron. Skeleton. I missed a lot of iron. Yeah, so you see, if I would have actually lit up this area like I should have, then they should not have spawned. Uh, and while I'm here, obviously, I'm going to go grab this iron, which I should have put back, but because I didn't think I was going to encounter any mobs, I didn't. But it's always nice, you know, finding, uh, knowing that you have a backup chest of resources if something happens. And just because... Uh, no... I think it was this way. Yeah, okay, cool. Big. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is simply put, I'm gonna surround this area kind of like torched up, and then this is gonna hurt. 
Actually, not. This could hurt. I'm gonna make a small tower. That I mean, in the horizon, you should be able to see this. And guys, as of right now, I have no way. I have no way in knowing if and when I could put this world possibly for up uh, download for you to play on the 360. Yeah, I can see my house all the way from here, so I'm actually not that far. But that doesn't mean I want to deal with it. And just because I took some damage, go ahead. And if you're thinking, why the hell did uh, I could have easily tunneled my way down using one of those? It's like, yeah, but then I have to put it back up. Okay, that was a dead end. But yeah. So there's actually quite a bit here that I've, by the looks of things, that I still need to explore. And I actually kind of want to get all the sandstone. Just because I actually really like sandstone. Oh, and there's a point. I missed another spot. See, you're, there's a good chance you're going to miss something like I just missed up here. Which for a second I thought, oh shit. But yeah, I mean, you're going to miss something the first time around. So it's always good to have these cave systems marked. So wait, later on you can come back through and s and know exactly where you're at. Because, uh, I mean, if you're going to go through cave systems, there's a good chance, even though you've been in, let's say, like the same cave, you know, like 20, 30 times, you miss something. I, until, like, there's literally, like, just a big-ass area that there's no blocks. It's all air. Uh, yeah, you just missed something. Because, I mean, the odds of finding diamond at level 20, I don't think it's, I don't think it's actually written in the code. If memory serves in the code, uh, you have to be at level six, 10 to 16 to find diamond. And, okay, I just, I did not. Whoa, whoa. Fuck the sand. I hate sand. And just because I don't want shit necessarily dropping in on me. Because that can be... Really? I love when I do that. Okay, so, yeah, I'm back through here. There's all the cobblestone. <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't like that. Even though it's not that dark, it's still, like, I think, like, I keep thinking, even though an area like that, the odds of a mob spawning is not that good. That doesn't mean it's not possible. Oh yeah, and before I continue on, because there's still quite a bit of dark areas, I want to go ahead and drop more iron down my in my chest, and maybe make another iron, uh, wooden sword, uh, not iron, wooden sword, another stone sword, and pop that up front, just because, and you know I'll do a pickaxe too. Yeah, I would rather be safe on some of this stuff than just like, oh shit. If you know what I mean. Because I mean, I'm looking, there's two areas that I can go. I'm going to go ahead and go through the bottom. Which, I see iron. And I see like another two areas basically I can go. And there's more. Okay, I found gold. Now, gold, you actually have to have iron to mine. The higher the ore level is, the higher the, basically, you have to mine. Like, see, there's two pieces of gold ore, at least two pieces right there. 
I need an iron pickaxe to mine it. And at the moment, I don't have that. But I do have all the materials if I go back to my little base to mine it. So I might just do that because gold is actually, it's kind of rare. And really, unless you're going to do the, what the hell? Oh, okay, yeah. Unless you're going to do the achievement where you need to go 500 uh, feet. Oh, okay, I was thinking, wait, wasn't there like a path? Oh my god, really? Like a path upwards? It's like, but yeah. Uh, gold is, that's really at the moment the only use. You can make uh, golden armor and weapons, but I truthfully don't recommend it. And I see a motherfucking spider. It's motherfucking ass is going to get owned. You got pwned, bitch. You're dead. Who's mad now, bro? Who mad? Heh. <laughs> I know that wasn't necessary. Now, if I'm lucky, oh shit, creeper, blow up. We got a second creeper. We got a creeper alert. Creeper, don't blow up. Huh? Creeper listened. I've never seen a creeper listen before. I want to say that there was a mod that you could actually have creepers as a pet, but I don't know why the hell. Oh, cool, more iron. Uh, you would ever want a creeper as a pet. That just kind of disturbs me, knowing that somebody really had that desire. I mean, okay, on the PC version, which, guys, is the real. Is it really the best version to play Minecraft on uh, for a mod level wise? Because the 360 uh, Microsoft is really like against mods. Although I think that there's a good chance there's going to be, if they'll implement it, there will be mods in the 360 version. Which if there are, I will probably go through and use quite a few of them so far the only mod I know for a fact I am not going to use because there's really like no need as of now not saying later there won't be a need for it but now is Optifine which if you guys don't know what that is basically it you can turn off like animation you can turn off things in the game that you don't necessarily need to run it and it will actually make minecraft run faster which as you guys can all imagine is a good thing but yeah oh wow we're like 40 minutes so honestly there's like each episode i'm gonna do with minecraft i think i want to spend like an hour doing I mean I found this pretty epic cave system I should render it out and split it up into like three or four parts is what I should do just for video wise oh I did not go down here but I mean yeah once you get into these cave systems although I want to take care of you yeah, these cave systems can get pretty fucking big. And I don't like you. Right now, I actually really don't need any water because I've yet to start doing any uh, gardening. Yes, I'm plan on gardening. Because uh, you actually do kind of need to guard... You, uh, guard uh, cool some lava oh my god 
Oh, okay, so I found another part of the dun uh, not dungeon, mine. Anything back here? I don't know. If there is, I'm not seeing anything yet. Okay, nothing back really back here. But just because of the fact it's kind of hidden, it's always worth just putting, um, I don't feel safe. If you know what I mean. I feel a bit safer knowing that there's cobble around it. So yeah. Uh, I don't know. I forgot what I was saying. Don't you guys love when that happens? More iron. I'm going to go ahead and go back to my little base. Smelt some of this iron up. And get some of that gold. Which... Yeah. It's like, I mean, I've done pretty well in one mine over, like, I went through, I think, like, three mines already today uh, in this one, in this let's play. So, yeah, I mean, I want to get that gold cause, just because of the fact gold, even though it's not really like, oh, my God, it's useful that doesn't mean I don't like gold it's like okay that's not the right way I hate when this happens when you can't remember how you get back or you take a wrong turn yeah it's okay it's up here actually you know what I'm thinking maybe Gravel, cobblestone. <sighs> Maybe I should end off the episode here and just worry about going through and mining the rest of this later. Because, I mean, it's been, it's already 40 minutes into this uh, episode, which I actually hope you guys enjoy these longer episodes. I mean, even though I didn't do a whole lot. I still managed to go ahead and find a pretty badass cave system. Which, honestly, if I can find more of these, I will. This is also part of the real life about Minecraft. We look for these cave systems that we can hopefully find some mob. Uh, well, not only mobs, but like some good uh, resources. I mean, I found a ton of coal quite a bit of iron and I know for a fact that there's still more for me to find but yeah so I'm actually gonna end it off here so that way next time when I come back well I've already been in a cave system that iron should hopefully be mainly melt smelt it so that way I can go ahead and make iron tools with it which actually are better than stone tools but I mean come on it's comments. It should be easy to figure that out. But yeah, comment down below. I want to know, would you guys prefer shorter episodes or longer? Because this is probably going to go on till the day Minecraft dies. Which I really don't ever see happening. And Well, if that whole Mayan 2012 the world ends bullshit. My the guys that believe in that, no offense. I think it's just a load of crap. I know mines were really good with uh, timing everything and whatnot, but I really just don't see that happening. Maybe some big event uh, happening. I'm expecting once it gets closer that the news is going to start covering it. Panic might break out. There might be ri some riots and whatnot, like uh, 2000 turned uh, with all the computers, uh, Y2K. There was a bit of uh, craziness. I remember that kind. Of, I remember like the news reports a little bit because I was I was really young. But yeah, okay, guys. Oh, I hope you enjoyed. Remember, rate, comment, subscribe, and peace. Okay, guys. If I did this right, the video is not over. You're gonna see a funny picture. Uh. 
game. Uh, G4 had posted this on Twitter earlier today or yesterday. I just found it really funny. And if you guys have yet to see it, I just thought I would show you. I honestly hope you guys enjoyed this. Remember, rate, comment, subscribe. If you hear, if you know what this is, and you saw this picture, comment down below. I want to know who's seen this picture. So yeah. Okay, guys. Not want to lose this. Oh my God! Thank you. It looked like I was gonna lose this audio because it had it had basically just stopped. It had frozen. Oh my God! I hate when that fucking happens thumbs up below if you've ever had that happen to you on a recording or something uh or if you thought you were gonna lose your data because your computer froze on you and you weren't sure if it was gonna go through or whatnot okay guys peace